friends, today I'm going to be testing out body wash slime two ways. Um, let's just get straight into it. For the first recipe, you're going to need something to make your slime in. Some body wash, I got this little travel sized Irish spring. Some salt. And something to mix with. So you're going to start by taking your body wash and putting however much you want into the container. And how much body wash you're going to put is probably about how much slime you're going to have. Now, we're going to add the salt. And um, keep in mind that when you use salt with this kind of stuff, you're going to want to be very careful. Because if you add too much, then you could ruin the slime. So, I'm just going to go in with like a very little bit. And then just put it in there. And it might not react immediately, which is why... um. When you're done, you're going to need to probably refrigerate it or freeze it. So let's get mixing that up. You see, it's kind of like clumping together. And be careful because if you add too much salt, it can actually melt. Now we're going to put this in the fridge for probably about an hour and I'm actually covering it up with a uh, plastic wrap so my whole fridge doesn't smell like body wash so I took this out of the fridge after a little over an hour and we're gonna open it up and see what the texture is like oh just right now it looks pretty runny it looks like it melted Do you guys see that like I don't know from before it looks like it melted um I don't know what I did. Maybe I added a little too much salt and then it just took time to go into effect. Um, I'm not sure, but this is really weird. So, um, I'm sorry guys, but I have to say that this is a fail. Now let's move on to the next recipe. Okay, just letting you guys know if you were wondering, I just moved downstairs for this next recipe. And for this one, you're going to need a container to make your slime in, the body wash, and some cream of tartar. So like the first recipe, you're just gonna put it in and how much body wash you put in here is basically about how much slime you're gonna get. Once you have your body wash in your container, you're gonna take your cream of tartar and you're just gonna put it in. And you don't want too much, you just want enough to where it kinda like, cause it's gonna kinda, I guess, dry up the body wash is what they said in the video. I got this from a video and you see it's already starting to thicken up once you have well combined your cream of tartar and your body wash you're just gonna leave that in your container for a few hours since it's already kinda like nighttime I'm just gonna leave it in overnight and I'll check in with you guys in the morning so I actually came up with a recipe last minute and I'm not sure if it's gonna work cuz I've never really seen it done anywhere but I thought you know it might work cuz if it's worked with um, other similar ingredients, I guess. So you're gonna need a container, your body wash, some cornstarch, and a mixing tool. Now for this one, I'm not sure how it's gonna work, so I'm just gonna add a little body wash at a time. And unlike the other ones, it's not really gonna be like um, as much body wash you have as how much slime you're gonna have. Now you're gonna go in with like a scoop of cornstarch, uh, just a little bit, not too much. And you're going to add that in. And um, you don't have to do it all at one time. You could just add it in little by little. And now you're going to stir it up. So as you can see, it actually looks pretty good. Like an actual slime. It's pulling together. And it kind of thickened up. And it doesn't stick to your hands too much. If it is sticky though, or it leaves a residue on your hands, you could just go in with another scoop of cornstarch. But don't do too much at a time, or else it will become all, like, dry. And you're just going to keep mixing it up, and adding more until you like the consistency. Okay, so here's what it looks like after I added a bunch of cornstarch. I like my slime not sticky, and this is what it looks like. I wouldn't call it a slime so much as a more clay kind of texture, if you will. And, um, 
just saying, I, it did happen off camera, so I can't really show you what it looks like, but if you reach a stage where your body wash reaches like a crumbly texture, don't worry, you just need to go in and knead it, or you can keep stirring, maybe after a bunch of stirring it will fix, but um, I just went in and kneaded it, and it started to like mold into an actual clay kind of texture. So yeah, it's really nice, it's actually soft, and it doesn't stretch too much, but it's super soft and nice to like poke, just like play around with. And I would say that this is a success. I don't know if I call it a slime, but it is a success if you're looking for something just like to play with. And this is made out of ingredients you probably already have at your house, so um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and also um... I haven't mentioned it much, but once I hit 50 subscribers, I will be accepting entries and giving details for entry for a giveaway to a $10 gift card to any place of your choice if you win. So don't forget to subscribe, and once I hit 50 subscribers, then I will give out details. So don't forget to share this to a friend, too. Bye-bye.